Now let's talk about bonding because part of the the joy of having a dog is that that bond. Like I got my dog at home and I come home, she greets me at the door, makes me feel good. Absolutely. But if you're training my dog, am I missing out on that opportunity to, to bond with my dog? That's a great question. And a lot of people think that they are, but actually I find the exact opposite to be true because we kind of go back to the owner's not a trainer. They're trying this, they're trying that, different things they saw on the internet. So what, what happens is, um, if you get frustrated with your dog, you're not really bonding. <laughs> you know, it's not a pleasant experience. Think of it as if you had a parent that wasn't the funnest to do homework with when you were a kid. Mm. You typically had the other parent that you would ask for help with the homework. You kind of avoided the other parent with homework anyway. Got uh, you. I had one of those parents. Uh, <laughs> so that's kind of the same situation with dogs. Uh, you know, one of you may get frustrated and training is not fun. We always want our dogs to realize training isn't training. It's fun time. So if she has fun training, then when we turn her back over to the, the owner, uh, when they're doing the repetition work and just engaging everyday life with their dog, training is now fun. It's not a task. Gotcha. So gotcha. it increases the bond, not decreases it. 